Hi guys, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can install the Apple Builder Software program on your iPhone. Now, this is on the iPhone 11 Pro. So the first thing you want to do is to go to builder.apple.com. So just launch a web browser and then go to builder.apple.com. And in here, you can see you need to sign in. So sign in with your Apple ID. So if you already have an Apple ID that you use, just simply sign in. Now, because I have already signed in, so there's no button for me to sign in again. Um, once you sign in, you can start to enroll your device. So over here at the top, I tap on enroll your device link. And down here, choose uh, what kind of device you are using. So I'm using an iPhone which uses iOS. So I tap on that and then I go down and then download profile. So tap on download profile. Now again, I have already downloaded the profile, so tap on allowed, and you can see here it says profile downloaded. And then what you want to do is go back to your home screen and tap on settings. In settings, you will see it will shows profile downloaded, and you tap on that to open up, and then you tap on install button, and we need to put in the phone passcode. And then we're just gonna tap on install button, and install and then done so now we have a, uh, a profile a configuration profile on the device installed and that's it so I'm just going to go back to um, settings and you can see that once it has been uh, installed it doesn't show up here anymore now from the settings screen we can now install beta software so I'm going to go down to general Go into software update and you can see here it say iOS 13.2 public beta. So tap on download and installed. I need to put in my phone passcode and it is now downloading and install the beta software onto the iPhone 11 Pro. Now, if you do not want to use this um, beta profile anymore, uh, you can also uh, remove it uh, from your phone. So to remove the profile, you go to General, Profile. So here it is, Profiles. And then select the profile that you want to remove and I just tap on Remove Profile. And that's it. So that's how you can uh, install Beta Software Profile on your iPhone. And if we go back to General Software Update, you can see it's still trying to download the update over here. And that's it. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.